What's up guys, MC Stu here, and today I'm gonna to show you how to get a custom resolution for your monitor. I'm running a super wide monitor 49 inch, that's 5120 by 1440, and the default options for the different resolutions for the game uh, just didn't uh, meet my needs or what I wanted uh, for the way that this monitor is laid out, and so there is a way to work around that, and that's what I'm gonna show you guys here today. So let's start with um, taking a look at what's here stock. So right now I've actually used this method to make it kind of this weird size so I could get it out of the place where it was fixed the way I wanted so I can show you how to get it back to that place or any other kind of uh, resolution that you want. So if we take a look in the options here on the game and we go over to graphics and we look at, um, so right now it's at kind of a, a weird one. Like I said, I just kind of changed that. Um, so I can go full screen. I can um, go with the next one down, which would be um, the 3840 by 21, but my monitor's 1440 tall, so that doesn't really work. Um, 1440, the next widest would be 2560, and that basically would use, you know, what, half of my monitor right about, or yeah, I'd use half of my monitor. And I wanted to be able to use a little bit more than half, so, you know, getting it to come over to about this spot here, and then still having enough room here to have Discord up or, the, you know, a browser or something like that. But I wanted to basically be able to use as much of my monitor as I could and leave me with just enough space to have up some other application, again, be it Discord or, or something else. Um, so the method that I found to uh, fix this is fairly straightforward, and I'm going to go ahead and walk you through on how to do that now. So what, what I'm going to be shooting for here is I want 2880 by 1440. So that'll get me just past halfway uh, of my monitor being used and still leave me most of this other side here or wherever I decide to put it uh, available for other uses. All right, so let's take a look at how we implement this custom resolution for Star Citizen. What you're gonna to wanna to do is navigate to where Star Citizen is installed on your computer. For myself, I have it on a specific drive, uh, my F drive. You're going to go to your Robert Space Industries folder, click into that, Star Citizen, and into the Live folder. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna add a text file here. And what we're gonna to wanna to do is, we're gonna to wanna to name this and we're gonna to want to change the dot txt portion of this as well. Um, if you do not see the file extensions on there, what you're gonna to wanna to do is go to the view. And if you take a look at file name extensions here, I believe that these are by default uh, don't show. Um, so if you can't see that, um, make sure that you come up and you enable that so that you can see it. Uh, so let me go ahead and turn that back on. I don't know if it shows, yeah, see, it doesn't show any click into it either. So you do need to make sure that um, you have under view in your, uh, your window here, file name extension. All right, so now that that's showing, we are going to look at this new file that we just did, and we're gonna rename this, and we want to also be able to change that file extension. And what we're gonna call this is user.cfg, and we're gonna wanna go ahead and save that. Yeah, it's a little off to the side. I'm just capturing half of my screen here now so that we can see what's going on a little easier. So we're gonna say, yep, we wanna go ahead and do that. All right, so now that we have that renamed, we're gonna go ahead and open this file and it is blank. And we are going to want to add this text in. I will put this text down in the description for you guys. Once this is in, you'll need to adjust your width and your height for whatever resolution you want. So again, for my purposes, I want to be able to take up a little bit more than half of my monitor here. Um, so I have gone with 2880 width and 1440 for the height. Um, so once you have this adjusted the way that you want it, go ahead and save that file. And we can close out of that. Now, if you were you know, just in Star Citizen or have the launcher up, you're gonna wanna make sure that you completely close out of the game and the launcher. Um, so use a you know, control shift escape and end task on it. Just make sure it is not running in the background. And uh, once this has all been saved and you're gonna go into the game now for the first time, you wanna do that completely fresh. So make sure that you shut everything down so nothing is running in the background and, um, and then go ahead and, and relaunch the game. So let's go ahead and launch the game and take a look at the effect. 
All right, and as you can see, the game has launched in that custom resolution that we wanted. Again, I run mine in windowed mode. That might not be preferable for, for everybody. Um, that's how I like to run mine um, because I'm trying to free up some space. So as you can see here now, the game is coming just past the center point here. Center point on my monitor is you know about so. Um, so I'm getting a little bit more. I could probably afford to go a little bit more, but as you guys know, Star Citizen is uh, not super easy to run. I can run it in full screen, but my computer starts to scream pretty loudly. So for me, this is you know wider than your kind of standard monitor, um, but it's not ridiculously wide, and I still have usability of this side of the screen here. So whatever your purposes are, whatever it is you're trying to do, that is how you can change the resolution from the stock settings. So if we take a look at the stock options now, you're going to see that it has added it to the list. If I scroll down here to the bottom, here's the custom resolution that I've added in and then all the other ones that were here before. Uh, even that uh, that weird last one that I put in looks like it's here. Yeah, the 1920 by um, uh, 1440. Um, so that's still there as well. Um, but that is how you, you add these um, this custom resolution. So if you just got a new monitor and things just aren't quite lining up right, or you only want to use a portion of it, that is a method that works. And I hadn't mess. I set this up probably, I've had this monitor for about two years and I set it up like this about two years ago and I haven't had to mess with it since through all the updates, patches, all of those kinds of things. I haven't had to mess with this file whatsoever. Um, it just works every time and uh, keeps the game at the custom resolution that I want. So if you have any questions, put them down in the description. There's also a Discord uh, channel listed down there as well. You're more than welcome to join. If you have questions, just go ahead and post them in there and we'll do our best to, uh, to answer those for you. Um, all right, guys. Well, I hope that was helpful. Till next time, have a good one. Appreciate you watching.